Hey, just a quick setup here. I was curious what if I had a bunch of points and each of them had some attributes like hunger, thirst, temperature, and what would happen if I slowly reduced each of those attributes over time at different rates, but then I placed locations on the grid, as you can see here, these three, that represent safe spots where they can regenerate this number. So I was just curious what would happen. So to explain it quickly, here are my survivors, the points here. And this square is blue for thirst, this one is for warmth, and this one is for food. Now they have a thousand of each attribute to start with, give or take a little threshold. And what they'll do is work out which one is in need the most, and they'll go towards that one. So if I click play and kick this off, you can see that they start whizzing around, running towards the thing they need most. And if they're running from here to here, but they suddenly, the first takes over, they will suddenly switch direction and go here. So that's pretty cool to see. I was just curious. And now I had another example here where I changed it to squares and I raised this one up to see what happened. And now I have them navigating in 3D space, which is pretty cool. They look like little guys in just navigating their way through the town. And now the last one, go back to the beginning, is I just went crazy with the point count. And now it creates this weird kind of shape <laughs> i don't know what i don't know what's going on with these guys here but yeah i just thought it'd be really cool to visualize it just something simple to start off with maybe we can do some crazy ai later but i want to try and do every effect possible so yeah it's pretty cool